Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today I am making some salmon. I am making a salmon with a creamy whole grain mustard topping on it. And it's just, I'm really excited to try it. It's super simple. And I don't think it'll take me more than 30 minutes to make. And it'll take me even less time to show you how I do it. So stick around if you wanna see how it turns out. Here I've got all of my ingredients for the garlic mustard aioli. I've got garlic, black pepper, salt, olive oil mayo, garlic whole grain mustard, and extra virgin olive oil. In this bowl, I have crushed together the garlic and the salt and added the mayo and mustard and some black pepper. This is gonna be the creamy aioli topping for the fish. Next, I put the fish into a baking dish with parchment paper and spread the aioli topping over the fish. Fish goes into the oven at 425 degrees. The next thing we're gonna do is make the side. So I've got some brown rice that I've already cooked. I made it in my Instant Pot, it's super easy. Um, but since the recipe already says that the rice is coming pre-cooked, you can use any rice that you've already cooked. I've got olive oil, green beans, frozen because I am taking a shortcut today. And then I've also got a lemon, which I will zest. And then instead of using pine nuts, I'm just gonna use what I have on hand because pine nuts are expensive. So go ahead and get this zested and get everything put together. All right, I'm adding my lemon zest, my nuts. I crushed them a little bit, but not a whole lot. Oh, sounds like it's time to get the fish out. Looks excellent and it's at 145. All right, now I've added the pepper, garlic, and salt. I added about three and a half cups of my pre-cooked brown rice, a little bit more salt, about another eighth a teaspoon, and also uh, two tablespoons of water. And that looks so delicious. This looks ready to go as well. Wow, so this is the finished dish creamy whole grain mustard salmon with a rice and green bean side. I also have some fresh lemon and parsley, which I will eat so they're not just garnishes. So let's go ahead and give this a try. Oh wow, that's really nice and flaky. I want it all together, so oops. Come here. It's so hard to <laughs> hold this and get food. Wow, that is so flavorful. Okay, I wanna eat this now, so. You've seen it, you like it, you love it, you're gonna make it. So that's pretty much it for me for today. Thanks so much for watching me make my creamy whole grain mustard salmon. I really hope you get to try this recipe and it turns out just as wonderfully for you as it did for me. And if you like this video, if you wanna see more of my videos, I also do videos of music, hair, especially locks. Um, and also a review here and there, but I've really been enjoying making recipe videos recently. So if you like this, if you like this recipe, if you tried it, let me know in the comments and also like and subscribe. I really appreciate you stopping by and I hope you have a great rest of your day.